Which is most effective for helping people learn? Punishment or reward? We'll consider the case of Israeli fighter pilot training, because instructors there found that negative feedback was far superior to positive feedback. If a cadet performed a particularly poor maneuver, they would reprimand him, but they noticed that on follow-up attempts, his performance invariably improved. In contrast, if they praised a cadet for executing a skillful maneuver, his performance on subsequent attempts typically declined. So naturally, they concluded that positive feedback is ineffective or even detrimental, whereas negative feedback is what works. The problem is, this seems to contradict a body of research that shows positive feedback is actually more effective than negative feedback. For example, <laughs> Even a week post-feedback, you could still see a physiological difference between the two types of feedback. Wow. Well, so why didn't this work for the Israeli fighter pilots? Well, maybe there are cultural differences, and in some cultures negative feedback works better. Or maybe it's task dependent. Perhaps some skills, like learning to fly a fighter jet, require more negative feedback. Or maybe the feedback had nothing to do with the performance of the fighter pilots at all. Maybe they would have performed in the same way regardless of the feedback 